Eating extra protein helps by providing building blocks for creating and repairing muscle. It helps you feel full and keeps blood sugar levels low. If you have any kidney issues, you should verify with your doctor before loading up on protein. Just because you want to consume more protein, doesn't mean that you have to supplement with protein shakes or bars, but those are good options. Here are some tips for slipping more protein in your diet. Eat more eggs. Eggs are so versatile. There are so many different ways that you can make them, and you can add them to almost anything. I like to fry up a bunch over medium style and put them in Tupperware in the fridge to eat all week. Many grocery stores have pre-shelled hard-boiled eggs packaged for convenience. Pre-cooked chicken or steak. If you cook chicken or steak strips at the start of the week, you can add them to salads, hot dishes, tacos, etc. Cheese. Cheese is a great protein-loaded snack. Cottage cheese is even better. Greek yogurt. Greek yogurt is higher in protein than other yogurts, and plain Greek yogurt is an excellent substitute for sour cream in Mexican food. It is also very good with nuts and berries. Add nuts. Nuts are nice to nibble, and work well as a topper on many dishes. Peas and soybeans. Peas and soybeans are great sources of protein and fiber. Add beans. Beans are good as a side, in hot dishes, or in salads. Use quinoa. Quinoa is a complete protein, good stock of fiber, and a good replacement for rice or pasta. Protein powder. Protein powder is awesome for making tasty shakes, but you can use it to put in your coffee, make cake, pancakes, protein pudding, or ice cream. Protein bars. Because of the convenience, and the fact that I found some that I really like, these are my go-to. Some of them are weak on the nutrition side, some have been a bit tough or chalky, but the ones that I eat lately taste like a straight-up candy bar. Add hamburger. I add browned hamburger to almost everything that I cook. Even just mac and cheese. Canned fish. Tuna or salmon can be added to so many dishes. One of my favorite comfort foods is just tuna and peas in thickened cream of chicken soup poured over toast, rice, or quinoa. I usually add one can of salmon to any tuna dish that I make. If you are seriously looking for a fast and natural weight loss solution, then I recommend that you click the link in the description. bestandbaddest.com slash health-and-wellness If you have any questions or feedback, please leave a comment. And if you found value in this video, please give a thumbs up, subscribe, and share it with your friends. Thank you for watching and see you next time.